Do I gotta wear the scarf? I served in the U.S. Army. Guys, I look like a combat barista. I served in the Navy. So are you guys just gonna generate a green screen behind me and put me into that weird Arab Aladdin looking marketplace but with nobody in it? Air Force. Marine Corps. Oorah. Ugh, one of those Marines. I was a 31 Bravo military police officer. Security forces. Ugh, you're an even worse version of an MP. You don't do as much and you never leave the gate, you fobbit. 82nd Airborne. All American. Radio operator. SEAL Team 1. Holy shit, I bet you got some stories, old timer. My service weapon was an M4 assault rifle. Wrong! The M4 is a carbine, not an assault rifle. An assault rifle is just a term used by civilians who don't know anything about guns. My service weapon was an M16. It's basically the same. You know what? It is the same. It's not the same. Specifically, the M4 has three selector switch positions. Fire, semi, and three round burst. Some of them still have automatic, but those are really for the cool guys, like special forces. Same weapon that's killed hundreds of people in the deadliest mass shootings in America. What about pistols? Are we gonna ignore the fact that pistols are used in most homicides? Like, a significantly staggering more amount of homicides? I know the power of this weapon firsthand. Power? I used to put the buttstock of my M4 against my junk and fire it off in front of privates to show them not to be afraid of the recoil. First hand. It's a varmint hunting round. First hand. It's a 22 with more powder behind it. And there is no reason. No reason. No reason. Why anyone other than military and law enforcement should have an assault weapon like this. Obviously you don't know shit about weapons because the selector switch is on fire for that weapon. And there's no rear sight aperture on that. How are you gonna shoot that thing? Plus, nobody shoots it with the butt stock all the way forward unless you got tiny T-Rex arms. Are these idiots aware that the AR platform is not allowed in some states? You can't have a pistol grip. You can't have a collapsible stock or a bayonet lug. Yes, a bayonet. You know, the knife that you put at the end of the rifle? Because so many bayonet charges are happening daily in the streets of Chicago. I believe in the Second Amendment and the right to bear arms. But that was created 200 years ago. Guns have changed a lot since then. You know what else was written on that 200-year-old document? The First Amendment. Free speech sure has changed in the last 200 years. Should that be regulated? I'm sure our founding fathers didn't imagine cell phones, social media, the internet, the ability to make contact with anybody and everybody around the world like that, where any and every voice can be heard, including the ones that are trying to unravel our democracy. But I don't see any protests about shutting down Facebook. High-powered. Rapid fire assault rifles. What the hell is rapid fire? It's semi-automatic. Just like 90% of all the pistols that are out there. No faster, no slower. It's your ability as a shooter that determines the speed and accuracy of the rounds fired downrange. Like the AR-15 are meant for one thing. Ooh, ooh, let me guess. A tyrannical government. One thing. Uh, protecting your personal property. One thing. Ooh, defense from those wishing to do you harm. That's not something I want in my country. They didn't even tell me what the one thing was. My name is Corporal Aiken. My name is Specialist LaHaye. Petty Officer, Second Class Day. Corporal Williams. Sergeant Yen. Airman Batesel. I'm Drill Sergeant High, and these idiots don't speak for me.